High blood pressure, also called hypertension, is when the force of blood against the walls of the arteries stays persistently high. Some people call hypertension the silent killer because it can cause problems and progress over the years without you feeling anything. The problem with high blood pressure is that it can damage vital organs in your body, as well as your blood vessels, which can lead to atherosclerosis or blocked arteries. For example, high blood pressure can lead to brain strokes, kidney failure, and fluid accumulation in the lungs, which will impact breathing. Countless doctors and researchers have agreed that to ensure a good outcome for hypertension, you must catch it early. This is why, in this video, we'll reveal to you 10 signs that your blood pressure is dangerously high. Now, without any further ado, let's get to it. Number one, severe headache. Even though this is a general symptom for numerous health conditions, however, if combined with the other signs that'll be mentioned in this video, it may indicate hypertension. Now, how can high blood pressure cause intense headaches? Well, high blood pressure can elevate pressure within the blood vessels in the brain, causing them to swell. These swollen vessels will become larger and apply pressure on tissues around them, which can result in headaches. Moreover, complications due to high blood pressure, such as atherosclerosis or blocked arteries, can affect blood flow to the brain, which further worsens the headache. In addition to that, high blood pressure can damage the protective layer between your blood and the brain. This layer is known as the blood-brain barrier, and it prevents harmful and excessive substances from reaching your brain. As this layer gets damaged fluids and other substances can enter your brain and cause swelling and headaches. Number two, fatigue. Constant fatigue that doesn't go after resting is another general yet indicating sign for hypertension. This fatigue can be due to the exhaustion of your heart muscles. When blood pressure is elevated, your heart has to exert more effort to pump blood through all your arteries. Over time, this makes your heart muscle get tired quicker, which you'll describe as fatigue. No matter how much you sleep, this fatigue will be persistent. The Hypertension Research Journal published findings from collected data showing that fatigue was one of the most common complaints reported by hypertensive patients. Number three, shortness of breath. After doing light activities, if you find yourself feeling breathless or can't breathe properly, then you may be suffering from hypertension. Your heart muscles get tired quickly after pumping your blood at a high pressure for a long time. So after a while, your heart stops pumping efficiently. The problem arises because then the heart won't be able to pump out the blood in it properly. In this case, the heart won't be able to accommodate blood from the lungs. So blood and fluid tend to accumulate within the lung tissue. This makes it harder to breathe. Number four, severe anxiety. High blood pressure can cause severe anxiety. This is because hypertension can impact your nervous system almost as much as it impacts your blood vessels. Hypertension often involves increased activity of the sympathetic nervous system, which is responsible for the fight or flight response. This increased sympathetic nervous system activity can lead to symptoms associated with anxiety such as increased heart rate, sweating, and heightened alertness. Research using physiological assessments has demonstrated that patients with hypertension often have higher levels of cortisol and other stress-related biomarkers. A study published in Hypertension Research showed that hypertensive patients had cortisol levels 15 to 20% higher than individuals with normal blood pressure. This cortisol is the stress hormone in your body, and it leads to anxiety. Before we continue, if you have been enjoying the video so far, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss more videos like this. Number five, nosebleeds. Nosebleeds can be a sign pointing to hypertension because high blood pressure exerts tremendous force on the arterial wall. It may cause it to rupture, especially in areas with delicate blood vessels like the nose. One study observed that about 17% of patients with hypertension reported frequent nosebleeds compared to about 10% in the general population without hypertension. Number six, chest pain. Pain, pressure, or tightness in the chest can signal high blood pressure. A study was carried out to examine the relationship between hypertension and the development of coronary artery disease 
on a sample of 10,000 patients over 20 years. It was found that those with uncontrolled hypertension had a 70% higher risk of developing coronary artery diseases compared to those with normal blood pressure. This is because hypertension contributes to the development of atherosclerosis. Atherosclerosis causes your arteries to narrow and harden, so it decreases the amount of blood they carry. Chest pain, which is usually sharp in nature, is caused when less blood and oxygen reaches your heart muscle. Number seven, irregular heartbeat. Irregular heartbeats means that your blood isn't following the proper contraction and relaxation rhythm. This is medically known as arrhythmia. Around 18% of hypertensive patients develop arrhythmia in 10 years of the start of their condition. A study was previously done where 5,000 individuals were monitored by electrocardiograms for 10 years. The results showed that those with hypertension are 2.5 times more likely to develop any heart arrhythmia disease. This can be attributed to the fatigue of your heart muscle. Adding to that, the stimulation of your sympathetic nervous system can lead to arrhythmia. Number eight, blurred vision. Visual defects due to hypertension can be described by a wide range of symptoms. You can say your vision is blurry, hazy, or cloudy, but at the end of the day, they are all just as dangerous. High blood pressure can cause the walls of the arteries in your retina to thicken to be able to withstand that high pressure. The problem is that when these arteries thicken, they also narrow, so the blood reaching the retina will decrease. Your retina is responsible for picking up light from your surroundings and translating and sending impulses to your brain. If your retina is damaged, then your visual field will be affected too. 15 to 30% of patients are suffering from hypertension experience visual effects. Moreover, this high blood pressure can negatively affect your optic nerve. Your optic nerve is responsible for transmitting the signals picked up by the retina to the brain. If these signals aren't transmitted properly, then vision loss may occur. This is called optic neuropathy. However, one of the most severe complications of hypertension is sudden vision loss. This occurs due to the blockage of blood vessels supplying your retina as a complication of hypertension. Number nine, blood in urine. If you find blood in your urine, then don't walk, but run to your nearest doctor. Like we mentioned at the beginning of the video, Hypertension can affect your kidney negatively. It does this by damaging the small blood vessels in your kidney. These vessels leak their blood into urine. About 10 to 20% of patients who have suffered from high blood pressure for a long time found blood in their urine. Also, those with uncontrolled hypertension are two to three times more likely to find blood in their urine versus patients with well-controlled blood pressure. Number 10, pounding in ears, neck, or chest. Do you feel pulsations in your ears, neck, or chest? When blood is flowing at a high pressure in vessels close to the skin surface, such as in the ears, neck, or chest, you may feel the pulsation of the blood. Furthermore, this pulsation is amplified due to the hardening of the arteries due to hypertension. This can be rather uncomfortable for most people. In some people, the vessels can actually be seen pulsating in these areas. So these were the top 10 signs that your blood pressure is dangerously high. If you have any of these signs, it's of great importance to seek medical attention at once to avoid serious health complications later on. Your doctor may prescribe some antihypertensive medications for you and advise you to constantly monitor your blood pressure. Now, we want to hear from you. Do you suffer from high blood pressure? Which signs from this video do you have? Share with us your experiences and opinions in the comments below. We love to hear them. Thanks for watching.